All right, good luck to uh, young Atkinson. He's trying to make it as a free agent. Speaking of young, trying to make it, here she is auditioning <laughs> for Kron tonight, the great Alicia. But I'm not a free agent, no, darling. You're, I'm, oh, I'm tied to you. Thank, all right, thank just Thank you saying. so much. I didn't, it didn't scare me at all, but I just, okay, go ahead. Okay, Jake, yeah. hiring a coach like Steve Kerr with no experience makes me think Joe Lacob wants to coach the team. Yeah, you're probably right. I don't think he wants to sit on the sideline and coach the team, but I'll give him credit. You pay... $500 million for a team, and you get up every morning and play basketball at mm -hmm. age 60. And you're he plays interested. every morning. Yeah. You're darn right. You're interested. <laughs> you think you know a little something about mm -hmm. the game. So, once again, he's not going to shove this guy around, but I, I firmly believe the key part is that he and Kerr are friends, mm -hmm. and they'll have a relationship uh, uh, that will translate, hopefully, to wins on the basketball court. Okay. All righty. Oscar says, Jackson out for a white golfing buddy of Lacobs. Sound funny to you? Yeah. Hey, listen. I, you know my line. I think there's, there's race in everything in life. And we got a lot of these this week from people who feel Mark Jackson mm -hmm. got uh, pushed out because he was black and uh, the owner went with more comfortable with a white guy. When you talk race though, and you and you label somebody one way or the other, you better really know them and have yeah. a body of work to make these comments. Mm -hmm. I don't know anything about Kerr, and I don't know Lake of that well, so I'm I'm not going to touch that because I don't know uh, enough to say anything with conviction. Okay, right. very good, uh, Andre. You always say the A's are a great team with no stars. Please tell me who is an all-star with the Giants. All right, Andre. I, I'll tell you. It, it, you. When I say stars, I mean people that get your palms to sweat. <laughs> no, you know what I mean? On the A's, that's Cespedes, you're interested. Mm -hmm. I think Tim Lincecum, even yes. though he's not pitching well, I think he's a star. He people made a care. Comeback recently. Yeah, they, he, they, people care what he does. Mm -hmm. Pablo Sandoval, you talk Absolutely. about. Oh, how's he hitting with his mm -hmm. weight down? You don't have to be having even a great season, yeah. but there are some guys that get people to lean forward. You're interested in them. They and get some guys the ballpark. who. Yeah, exactly. Posey, come on. Everybody loves Posey. Uh, quit buttering everybody up, Posey. <laughs> All right, go ahead, girl. Everybody does. All right. Okay, Thomas, watch the NBA players for 15 minutes, then switch to a baseball game. That sport is for old people. Thank you, Thomas. That's why I watch so much more basketball. There you, you know. go. No, it is true. I mean, a little bit of baseball, it's just, you got to sit there and you got to think and you got to think. And basketball, a good game. Now, bad basketball game is a bad basketball yeah. game. But I tell you, you have a good game, I'll give You're you basketball in. for entertainment value anyway. A little, little edge. Okay, all righty. And Katie, Wednesday morning on 2nd Street, I yelled, mention my name. You said, sit through an hour of Kron, and I will. <laughs> I'm watching you and your wife Friday. So You're, you're done right. Hello, Katie. Yeah, Hello. yeah. No, I was going to do the show from the ballpark, and that's exactly that's a good one. I said, you sit through one hour of our there you go. and Pam, and she sat through a full hour of it. Of course. Yeah. All right. There you go. Thank you, Katie. You're welcome anytime to watch Cron, and don't forget we're your John Finolio station. Back to Pam Moore. All right.